regret that right now we didn't do our three shots. But we could we have calmly taken it, it's round. I'm guessing 17, 18 degrees. It's really nice and comfortable. The sun is shining, it's really warm and warm. And the beach is really nice, like it's literally has algas. Seaweed, seaweed. It literally has no seaweed, no shells from anything. Just so we arrived at uh, Los Cristianos. Sunny, no wind at all almost. It was a little bit crazy on the highway. We're seeing on the GPS that there have been some accidents, haven't seen anything like quite serious. It was just some scratched bump car, so but everybody was like, oh what happened? Let's see, wow, and they were stopping and creating a flexible ticket. What are you gonna say? Do you regret <laughs> you didn't take your swimming shorts? Uh, it's not a problem for me. For some of us it is. I can remove the t-shirt. friends how are you doing we are chilling on this amazing beach in uh, uh, Los Household we are chilling on this amazing Los Americanas Americos beach the weather is amazing the water is amazing and we are so lucky to catch in exactly our last day some nice weather here so we can finally visit this nice part of the island and <laughs> Denny is very happy <laughs> it is very beautiful and our holiday is close to the end but if it was a little bit earlier, I think we could go to the island which is right there and it's called I think Las Palmas, I'm not really sure but every day it's getting hotter and hotter by the days that are passing and yeah. it's getting closer so we go to, the, to Denmark I'm quite scared of like 25 degrees change in temperature it will be yeah it's <laughs> it's one degree in Denmark and here now it's 30 close to 30 and it was very very hot it's burning my head hurts he called his mother and <laughs> she said like hi how are you and she was with the hat in the snow in Romania and the gloves and everything she was packaged all the way up and I was like in t-shirt and sweating <laughs> I didn't know what to remove yeah and uh, in Bulgaria it's also snowing in Denmark most probably it's raining but it's, it's super it's cold raining. with yeah. a lot of wind yeah. and it's really nice to admire this beautiful view like I think 
I think that right now it's kind of the same like the hottest day that we had in Alborg this year like the temperature and how it feels I think it's exactly the same and I don't know it's just amazing to see the palm trees the houses and everybody enjoying the sun and staying on the beach and it's so like unexpected it's November and <laughs> people are staying to catch some sun and staying at the coffees It's, it's great. So, we just ate at Hard Rock Bar and restaurant yeah. and whatever and everything. everything. <laughs> <laughs> um, I had a Caesar salad and um, Alex had a burger for the Caesar for the Caesar salad. You had to choose Caesar salad and then you could have had chicken or salmon. But if you want to add chicken or salmon. It costs additional price. Conclusion: It was a little bit overpriced. Yeah, and the other thing was that um, the chicken was very, very dry and overdone, and basically you had to chew it a lot. But and I, I don't really have what to complain about. The burger was it was not the best. It was a good burger and the portion was really big like I barely managed to finish the burger I couldn't finish the french fries I had sauce they offered me ketchup, mustard, onion uh, my knees, whatever I wanted and it was like included in the price it wasn't something else and the drinks were really good um, at least uh, I had a non-alcoholic cocktail and it was really nice. Um, that was she had just water. <laughs> <laughs> because because I thought that he wants to drink something alcoholic. Alcoholic. With alcohol. So I drive the way back. That's why it took water. And then she said, but I'm not feeling comfortable and stuff like this. And then the guy came and we didn't synchronize. So we ended up not drinking. <laughs> yeah, but still the, the resort is really nice. Like it's, it's purposely made resort for like holidays, like beach holiday, not house, for example, in Santa Cruz, where it's mostly like an old city and the bad part the bad part in my opinion is right now the weather is real nice and you have what to do because it's not raining it's very hot outside so you can go in the morning to the beach you can probably um, spend some uh, some time in a restaurant outside but I think the problem is right here if you if it's raining and or the weather is bad is not sunny you don't have what to do you can just stay in the hotel and go inside the restaurant stay inside because it's cold outside but for example in Santa Cruz even if it's bad you can go it has like three malls uh, it has shopping centers it has museums it has uh, artworks parks on the streets and overall I think the weather was better because out of seven days that we stayed here uh, here in the southern part it rained five and in Santa Cruz it was just like a little bit of sporadic rain maybe 15 minutes but otherwise it was a little bit cloudy 
but it was still enjoyable you could stay outside so I honestly I would recommend if you want to come here during the winter and you're not sure if the weather is gonna be perfect amazing just go for the safe option for Santa Cruz because it's, you have more things to visit and you can always rent a car and come down here just as we did and, and spend the day And we just didn't want to risk going to the Siam Park because... Because we didn't know and we were not sure if the weather is going to be nice here. Like nice enough. And the, tickets, the ticket is around 40 or 50 euro per person. So if we spend 50 euro to, to just go there, spend two hours without sun being cold and then just leave it would have been like a really waste day. So we just took the safe approach. But yeah, it's nice. So hope you'll come and visit.